Welcome everyone to episode 515 of Bull Feet's Current Call. I am your host, the man that does walkthroughs, playthroughs, gameplays, vlogs, that's my Yu-Gi-Oh cards, all the stuff man could ever imagine, and that's Bull Feet 224. That's also game news for this weekend here. Let me let, let me load up my um my um. Yeah, yeah, cause my my laptop is it's acting kind of funny, but I don't, but I gotta take care of it once a day. But anyways, <clears throat> okay, this week Capcom released the full Street Fighter Six character theme song for Zangief and series newcomer Lily. Capcom describes Zangief's new theme as a tune that can amp up an audience for a wrestling match, while Lily's theme is said to invoke the cheerful feeling of strolling around the Thunderfoot settlement. Let's see if I found some information on this. Sit back, relax, and have a listen to both new Street Fighter 6 themes via the YouTube links below. Street Fighter 6 launches on launches June 2nd on Steam, PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, and Xbox Series X and X. Keep your notified generation for more Street Fighter 6 news. Over on Twitter, Tekken Series producer Kazuhiro Arata recently answered some random questions from fans that ended up casually dropping new, de new details on Tekken 8's development. When asked if Tekken 8 will feature crossplay, Harada replied, of course, and mentioned he proposed crossplay for Tekken during the previous generation of consoles. See if I find information for this. When asked how many characters fans expect in Tekken 8, Herodas replied, I think that's a more a lot more than Capcom signed. <laughs> Anyways, <clears throat> in, in in reference to Street Fighter 6's starting roster of 18 characters. In another tweet, Harada headed that a Tekken 8 online beta is already in the plans. We are still only Clo doing, doing close alpha testing at each event, so please wait for the beta," said Harada in, in the tweet below. Rollback netcode is another common tom topic that other that, that comes regularly when discussing other fighting games. On that front, Her Harada also commented in front of a fan of Rollback netcode is already installed in Tekken 8. After all, Rollback netcode is already implemented on Tekken 7. Okay, when Harada Sun didn't elaborate any further on these upcoming features, we at least now have official confirmation from the producer itself that Crossplay, Roadnet Code, and an online beta are being planned are already in the works for Tekken 8. Stay tuned on Final Generation for more Tekken 8 news. Okay, is it it's an announcement of an announcement. With Street Fighter 6 launching less than two months away from now on June, Capcom announced that 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 they still have more to show before release day. A special Street Fighter 6 showcase will air on Thursday, April 20th, 2023, which is on thir on on Thursday. So 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 by the time I do I do I do I do the Street Fighter I do Street Fighter series this, this Thursday, Street Fighter 6 is perfect for um for for for, for Street Fighter Thursdays. Anyways, Capcom announced that there's still more to show before release Anyways, a, a Switcher Street Fighter 6 showcase will air on, thir on Thursday, April 20th, 2023, while Capcom confirmed will have big news and announcements. The digital event, wait for it, will be, will be hosted by rapper Lil Wayne. We'll be, we'll be joined by Capcom's developers and talk about World Tour, Battle Hub, and Fighting Ground modes in Street Fighter 6. Capcom said the 30-minute digital presentation will include some big news at the end of the show. The official trailer above includes in, in, include, in, includes some interesting new gameplay footage of the character's various modes. Reveals a new alternate costume for Kimberly, furthermore a short cousin on trailer hands of Damden from the Final Fight series, who previously appears as a background character in Street Fighter VI, maybe jumping into the action in some form. Check out related screen grabs from the from from from, from the from, from, Screen grabs from the trailer below. Okay, Street Fighter Six produced Street Fighter Street Fighter Six director Takayuki Nakayama also shared his new concept artwork for Kimberly's new outfit. 
check out the new article link below. Street Fighter 6 launches on June 2nd on PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Steam, and Xbox Series S and X. Keep your eye on region for more Street Fighter 6 news. And last but not, not and last but not least here, Street Fighter 6 director and designer Takayuki Nakayama just shared some fresh concept artwork from Kim Kimberly's alternate outfit that was briefly teased in the most recent trailer. While we haven't seen Kimberly wearing her new outfit in actual gameplay, the official Street Fighter 6 showcase trailer revealed Kimberly donning her alternate outfit in her intro in, in, in her intro animation. The latest concept artwork is definitely a, diff a different style than previous Street Fighter 6 con concept illustrations we we've seen thus far, with a chibi appearance. Take a look at Kimberly's new look in the official artwork followed by a screenshot of the alternate outfit. Okay, directly above is the official Street Fighter 6 showcase and outfit trailer that was pre pre previews Kimberly's new outfit in case you missed it earlier. Once again, big news and announcements for Street Fighter 6 are coming Thursday, April 20th during the special presentation hosted by Lil Wayne. Keep your fire generation for more upcoming news and announcements for, for Street Fighter 6. Anyways you guys, that's it for my game news there on my channel update. Um I did a lot a lot of videos th th this week today but I took I took I took Sunday off so yeah. So I so I did my twenty second gameplay on NFL Blitz Yeah, on the NCC4, because uh, today is NCC4 Sunday, uh, NCC4 Saturdays. I got to do NCC4 so Saturdays today. So anyways, I did Fossil Cover, six matches. I also did my third gameplay on Wayne Gretzky's 30 Hockey 98. I also did, let's see, um, my, 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 my 90th workout video. I also did one Virtual Fighter 2 match. I need to take a break from from, from the T battle mode, anyways. I also did seven Blood and Road Power matches. I also did one match of the last Bronx of, of last Bronx. I also did my, my 91st workout video. I, like I said before, I'm doing these workout videos six times a week now. So yeah. I also did my my, my, my 40th Tekken 2 team battle mode gameplay. I also did seven Dragon Ball Z Budokai one matches. My 37th Tekken Three team battle mode gameplay. I also did my 92nd, my 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 92nd workout video. I also did seven Soul Calibur one matches. I also did two matches in Psychic Force 2012. I also did my 93rd workout video. I also did seven Ultra Street Fighter two matches, and I also do two. Street Fighter Third Strike matches. I also did my 94th workout video. Um, I also did seven. I also did seven King of Fighters 15 matches. I also did one Dragon Ball Z Budokai 2 matches. I also did, and I also did a play. I also did a story mode on King of Fighters Maximum Impact. I'm so sorry that I didn't do any any Maximum Impact story modes for for a while now. It's been like a couple of years now since I took a break from it. But now that I'm but now that I'm back doing more, hopefully I can do hopefully I can do more on King of on on, on King of Fighters Friday, uh, on King of Fighters Fridays, cause that cause cause King of Fighters Maximum Impact it counts as a King of Fighters title, so that's gonna be part of King of Fighters Fridays, every every Friday. So anyways, another note um. The time the time that I, we we just suffered a lot a lot of rain as you can see. My my, my 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 game my, my, my game room slash bedroom is un, is unharmed. I'm doing fine. So hopefully in the near future I'll try to track down some 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 PlayStation 2 games, some GameCube games. Maybe I can I can upgrade my PlayStation 2 to to a slim PlayStation 2 so I can do do more PlayStation 2 gameplays and, and playthroughs in the near future. So please stay tuned for more videos in the near future as well. Yeah. Well that's gonna do it with another episode of Bullface Current Call. I hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like my videos or a comment, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Go back and watch our episodes. Don't forget to ring that way to notify for any new videos here. And make sure you're on YouTube membership as well for early access to new and unreleased videos. And don't forget to like me on Facebook.
Follow me on Instagram and TikTok and the Nintendo Online and also on PSN. Until the next video, you guys, stay connected. Peace!